Hi, this is Ruth Kramer. I am your holistic soul healer. Obviously, I'm totally laid back in your creative flow right now. So, how laid back are you in your creative flow? Are you relaxed and into your life? And what is creativity for you? It's different for everybody. So, let's talk about all the different creative things you can do. And obviously, I'm wearing my top of creativity, all different colors. Um, and so creativity is birthing and rebirthing yourself in every moment in many different ways. So some people are creative with finances, some people are creative with writing, some people are creative with all different art media, some people are dancers and singers, and this was a place for a parade ground in the World War I. We're in an old amphitheater, it's got so much history. So what about those soldiers who are parading up and down in their beautiful uniforms, all those lovely bright colours and they were creatively cleaning all their brass buttons? That was creativity too. So I don't want any one of you to decide that you're not creative because I can't tell you how many people I've heard in the past that said I'm not creative. But you have to be because you co-created this life that you're standing in, right? So you were born and in every moment you get to rebirth yourself in this life and reset yourself. It's like resetting, restarting, rebooting your life like a computer. So when you take a look at colours, and I've got plenty of colours on me today, your favourite colour might not even be on this shirt. So what is your favourite colour? And when you see this shirt, if your favourite colour's on here, does it pop and stand out to you right at the beginning? Or do you have to search for it? Is it not even here? So and what does that mean to you? And in the area where you do your most creativity, whether it's financially, emotionally, spiritually, mentally, all of those places are creative juices flowing through you because it's all about you creating the life you want, which is the whole reason why we're doing this step program. So of course this part of your program, this seventh step, and seven is heaven, right? This is your creative juices. This is creating the life that you want. What are you doing every day, in every way, to take a step towards what you want? So I want you, part of your homework assignment, is take a look at how you're balancing your analytical mind and your creative juices. How are you flowing into your life? Are you flowing? Maybe you're not. Maybe you feel stuck. Well, come on, let's get moving here. So I want you to paint, I want you to draw, I want you to write, I want you to journal, I want you to meditate, I want you to breathe, I want you to wear your colours. And if your room of creating your life is not the room you want, is it painted in your favourite colour? If it's not, let's go, let's paint a room, let's put up something that depicts your favourite colour to get you passionate and excited about your life. Because without the enthusiasm that's lit like a beautiful flame right here in your creative belly, where all these colours live, you're not lighting the fire of enthusiasm for your life. So this step seven, there's two homework assignments for you to do this week. One of them is take a look at where your juices aren't flowing and go do something, even if you have to take a class. It could be yoga, because movement is still creative. It's moving you into your life. If you're not journaling, start journaling. If you're not drawing or writing or designing or painting or fixing up a house or, or doing something in your business, um, if you're not creating more financial wealth and freedom, take a look at what you aren't doing and let's bring in something to get you doing it. So that's one of your homework assignments. The other one is choose your favourite colour. Find out what colour really does it for you. My favourite colour is obviously yellow. Um, and I love it when I wear yellow. It makes me happy. It makes me feel like I'm flowing. I get excited. My fire's lit from within. Make sure that you're wearing and doing something in your life where that colour starts to predominantly come in. So that could be having something in your car that's your favourite colour. Me, I've got a little sunshine person in yellow that I put in my car. So take a look at what you do in your life that helps you to be more creative. So welcome to step seven. I'll see you next week in step eight. And this is your creative life right now that you're making. And I'm Ruth Kramer, your holistic soul healer. Thank <laughs> you.